viewers i hope you are all fine this ultrasound video shows a case of anencephaly anencephaly is a lethal anomaly which can be detected on ultrasound as early as 11 weeks of gestation if some amount of neural tissue is present the condition is termed exencephaly polyhydramnias is usually associated with neural tube de defects you can see the fetal head size and both the eyes are prominently seen but cranial vault is missing these are both the eyes seen prominently on the face of the fetus but skull bone is missing Again, you can see the fetal brain. Uh, this is the fetal face. This is the chest cavity. You can see the fetal cardiac activity. The, there are vigorous fetal movements. This is hand of the fetus. You can see all the fingers are intact. Theoretically, anencephaly can be diagnosed as early as eight weeks. However, it may be missed in the first trimester. There is 100% accuracy in the second trimester for this diagnosis by ultrasound. Anencephaly is when neural tube fails to close at the base of the skull. Neural tube defects may be caused by genes and genes passed on from both the parents and by environmental factors. Some of these factors are obesity, uncontrolled diabetes in the mother and intake of some medicines during pregnancy. Now again you can see the fetal cardiac activity, fetal chest cavity. Fetal cardiac activity is eco normal. Fetal cardiac activity is visible and audible. And carefully develops when the neural tube fails to close at the base of the skull. Neural tube defects may be caused by genes passed on from the parents. Anencephaly is characterized by the absence of cranial vault. Most severe form of this uh, cranial neural tube defect is anencephaly and it is characterized by absence of the cortical cortical tissue although the brain stem and cerebellum may be variably present as well as absence of the cranial vault. You can see the hand of the fetus. Both the hands are visible. All the fingers are intact. Anencephaly is the most severe form of cranial uh, tube defects. The morphological spectrum within anencephaly ranges from allocrania, the most severe form, to mirocrania, mildest form. Now you can see the fetal lower limbs. Both the femur are visible along with the umbilical cord. As with many other malformations, a number of associated abnormalities may be recognized. Other neural tube defects such as spina bifida, especially cervical, cranial heart defects, cleft lip or cleft palate, diaphragmatic hernias, and many other fetal anomalies may be associated. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel. If you do like this video, please click the like button. Thanks.